So today we are doing a live trade and the pair that we are going to trade together is GBPUSD. For me, I believe GBPUSD is a buy. For me, I believe it, ah, not a buy, oh, sorry. For me, I believe GBPUSD will sell. And the reason why I want GBPUSD to sell is because already uh, my pair has already given, my strategy has already activated. So we will, we will do the lesson 90. So today is lesson 90. And in this lesson 90, I want us to discuss GBPUSD and why I think it is a sell. One thing I need to tell you guys is that um, for me, I believe that on Tuesdays, normally I'll get trades to trade. But this this week, Tuesday, I never got a trade because the market was was dragging behind. And you see, when the market drags behind, there's nothing you can do. There's nothing you can do, guys. So it's Thursday, and it's time the market has given a sell opportunity. So let us discuss. By the way, comment down below, what do you think GBPUSD will do for me? I still believe it will. It is a sell, and because it has confirmed, um, there is not there is no turning back. So the only thing you need to do if you place a sell limit, a, 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 a sell order, just use proper risk management. That's the only thing I can tell you, because at eleven fifteen we have news on euro, and at twelve we have news on GBP at 12 30 we have news on GBP so uh we'll have news and you know news can can affect in a good way or a bad way so I don't want us to you had over risk just keep in mind because there's news I will not over risk okay so if you're watching this video before I make this video they the news is not released. So maybe it either will fasten or it might affect. So that keep that in mind. We have news on pound and euro. So before even we go to our live trade on GBPUSD and even I enlighten you on how the market is going on, I just want to tell you that you need to do top-down analysis every time you get an opportunity. You need to tell your mind, by the way, Am I really going to sell top-down analysis? Why? Because these top-down analysis are the ones that gives you, um, they are the ones that gives you everything. So top-down analysis on GBP USD from the monthly, and because it is going, it will be selling more than 200 pips. So let's consider doing a thorough top-down analysis. So back in 1985, if you don't know, GBP USD have a double bottom. This is a double bottom back in 1985. So you have a double bottom there. And this double bottom is a double bottom on a downtrend, meaning we are trying to reverse what the market has done. If you have been carefully listening to my videos, by the way, I'm remaining with 10 lessons. Oh my goodness. We have done now 90 lessons since lesson one. If you have listened to those lessons, I always say double bottoms on a downtrend, they are not as easy as you may think. Why? Because you're trying to reverse a market and the trend is already a downtrend. So you're trying to come to buy. So it is not easy. And that's why you see the market has really, um, it has never reached half. You can see the half is a bit far, but quarter half of the half, the market reached quarter half of the half. So the market, yes, it reached quarter and that is it. And even went above, but it has never reached half. And I believe the reason why the market has never um, went to the half is the fact that this is a downtrend and we are trying to counteract the, the market. Another thing, yes, we have a double bottom Yes, you have a double bottom in 1985, but as a result of the market, as it was coming to activate the bottom, we had another new pattern. So I believe that was pattern one. We had this pattern two. You can see these are double top. And you need to understand the double top is more recent. This double top is more recent than the double bottom. So even if you come and tell me, oh, monthly we have a double, uh, bottom in 1985, 
also consider that we still have a double bottom, a double top uh, that happened between 2017 and 2021. So we have a double top. Why do you think this double top is accurate? Because the double top on a downtrend, making it easier. And you can see the market didn't struggle. The market to come to uh, the market didn't struggle even to go to the neckline, to go to the half, the market went to the half. The market never struggled. So you can find out that any pattern that has supporting, um, you see, the way the market just is supporting, the market didn't, there was no restriction. There was no, the market didn't have so many obstacles. So we have a double top and the market continued to go down. And even after the half was broken there are no much retracement in the market hit half now the thing you need to understand is that once the neckline is broken the market is supposed to go this distance the market is supposed to go which distance this distance so the market is supposed to go this distance we are doing top-down analysis i know majority of you have never had such analysis before but allow me to do this analysis because if at all you will place a sell trade, why are you even placing the sell if you don't know what the market has been doing? So the market did not reach to our half. If this market activated our half, and that's why we are told, if the market is almost our half, it's like they were done with this double top. And that's why the market went up. And if you can notice, the half of this double top, the half of this double top is where the market came back. If you can notice, the half of this double top after the market broke is exact zone where the market came. It's like it came to retest to that area. So for me, I believe this market has even a potential of coming to this back to this zone. It has a very high potential of coming to this zone. For me, that's what I believe. It has a high potential of coming to back to this zone. Now, according to our double top, this is our retracement. And this retracement, it seems like it is floating because there is nothing that caused this uh, market by breaking resistance with the two green candles. There was nothing here that made this market just to stop because you don't have a support, a resistance, sorry. So the market just reached back in uh, August, this of, August of this year, the market broke resistance, tested the half of the same double top and started to go down. And I'm wondering why did the market stop? And now once it is going down, we are not sure. We have seen even the break of, um, the break of current support with green green so it's like it has done the same thing and the market now is coming up so we need to ask ourselves first of all why did that market stop if we remain on monthly we'll never know but at least the bigger picture we need to understand is that why did the market just retrace the half of this double top and stop all of a sudden so if we go to the weekly time frame the place that the market stopped, you see, this is the where the market stopped. The place where the market stopped, if we look on the left, there was a resistance that is not found on the monthly. And that resistance is good enough to give us a double top. So we started to have OPT on the weekly that is all not on the daily. And let me tell you guys, when you have OPT on the daily, on the weekly, and it's no longer on there, it's not on the you have it on the day, weekly and it's not on the monthly, it becomes very strong. So if I flip on the monthly, there was nothing. And that's why the market started to go down even without us realizing what was happening. So on the weekly, the market has that double, uh, the double top. And um, you can imagine monthly has a double top. There's a double top on the monthly. This is the double top of the monthly. And also now on the weekly, we still have a double top, meaning sell is very strong. And this double top is only on weekly. So if I come to the weekly time frame and I mark my neckline and I mark my half, it is evident enough that this market, they are pushing towards, they are pushing towards what? They are pushing towards coming 
to her. So for me, what I believe, first of all, this market wants to go to half. That's what I believe. From where the trade is right now, from where the trade is, the market wants to push to half. And that is 818. So we have 818 pips and the market is about to push 818. 18 pips. So that is the one analysis on the weekly. Why? That double top, the market will obey it. Now, I want you to pay close attention with what we are doing. We got the bigger double top on the monthly. Can you see there was this double top on the monthly? I don't know. I want you to follow closely how these people, the banks, they manipulate us. You can see the same double top on the monthly, but they cannot give you a double top on the same time frame if they, they want to take down. So there was a double top on the monthly, and when they now were assured that the retracement was over, the double top that started to take the market down was found where? Was found on the weekly, All right? Now we have a double top. We have a double top on the weekly, you see, we have a double top on the weekly and the market first stopped around here. So we need to ask ourselves, why is this market stopping here? Why does the market stop around that area? So the only reason that this market stopped here, we can go and check why did that market stop around there? So if we go to the daily time frame, we will see the only reason that the market stopped, it's because it had our a double bottom. So yes, the market, we are hoping it will go to the half of the double top of the weekly. I hope you're following. But because the market has been coming down, coming down. And from the weekly, you can't see this double bottom. You see, these things are hidden so that you continue to sell. So anyone who has been selling using weekly, they are now doubting themselves because they are selling. Everything was okay. But for long, the market has gone up within the 505. So they are thinking, did I make the right choice to hold my trade? So there's a double top on the weekly and the market as it was going down very well. On the weekly, they can't give you a pattern, but they will give it on the daily. So the daily double bottom is what they used for a while. So according to the daily double bottom, where is our half? Can you see our half guys? According to the daily double bottom, that is only one time frame, the market reached half. Let me tell you, I was on this trade and I think I gave up on this buy around here. That's when I said, I don't want to buy it because for me, I felt this market will never go to the half. But surprises after a long time, after a long time of holding, because this market gave an entry. I don't know if you can remember this trade, Give us an entry here. And let me tell you the, the obstacle that this market had. So once the entry was given, once the entry was given, it will, we went on a drawdown of 23 pips. And then the market first, nonstop, it went 200 pips, nonstop, 200 pips, because the distance was too huge, it was 429 pips. So the market nonstop, they went 200 pips. They started now arranging. But the thing is the double bottom because it's not on the weekly guys, it is very, very strong. It will head to the half. And let me tell you, they will do so many things to make that pattern not to succeed. And this was one of it. They made sure they give you a double top an early double top. And I know majority here were lost. Majority here, they were lost. Why? Because now people started to sell when it was too late. You cannot sell when you know this double bottom, the, ag the agenda of this market is to hit the half. So when people sold, and, uh, and even they made sure that the market has has um, broken half so that you are even selling with confidence. By the time you're selling like that, they made sure on four hour, they'll give you a pattern, a double bottom that is not on the daily. So I, I think now you understand how the market plays out.
Now let's continue. So weekly, we have a double top that is not on the monthly. So when it comes to daily, they already know for the only thing that we will make sure we start to sell and weekly time frame, we don't want it to be heavy is having a double top. So, and that's exactly what has happened. After half is done, out of the market activated half, let me tell you, this market dropped crazy. After the half was activated at 25.60, the market dropped with 115 pips. Now at that half, the market has activated a new double top. And we need to ask ourselves, is this double top only on the daily time frame or it's available even on the weekly? So note the area where they are creating a double top is very, very unique area. It's an area of the half of the double bottom. So if you pay attention like that, there are some things you will know. So there is a double top that is on the daily. And then when we flip on the weekly, it is not there. Can you see? It is not there. So what is happening? Let's start from the monthly. Monthly, the double stop started here. 2021, that is the second activation. The market dropped. Back in 2023, they decided they will not give you the double top using the monthly. Let's flip and go to the weekly. And notice the double tops have something unique. They are not in another time frame. So they give you a double top on the weekly and you can see guys, the double top after the activation, the double top has dropped with 735 pips. So the double tops are very, very strong. And then now on the daily, we still have a new double top. We still have a new double top guys. So this double top that we have, we still have a new double top. So this double top that we have, it's not on the weekly. So what do we do? We calculate to see where our half is. So this is our half and our half is 2290 and this is our neckline. All along the double top on the monthly did it reach to the neckline? Yes, it did. It, did, it reached to the neckline, as you can see. The double top on the weekly has never reached to the neckline because this double top, first it needs to reach to half before even it reached to the neckline. Let me make the half um, a different color. So they first even need to reach half before even they reach neckline. So as you're even trading, as you are trading daily, don't forget that we still have a double top on the weekly and the market can come, can come down, get to the half of the double top on the daily, get to the neckline on the daily and they will be targeting the half of the weekly. So it can even drop 800 pips. So now we are on the daily time frame. We have realized what the market is doing. So the only thing now you need to enter on this trade and I have been waiting, like we waited where it is WBB. So WBB means there are three entry signals. Number one, you wait for a red candle. And once that red candle comes, you check if it's bearish angle. So even we got a bearish angle uh, and I'm using FXM. So that's a bearish engulfed. The market engulfed the whole green candle. So if you're watching this trade, the price should go down because today we have pound news. This pound news should take this market down to 218 pips by the end of today. So your take profit should be 2290 or it can be even 2300. So your take profit should be at 2300, guys, 2300. And let me tell you, if this half is broken, continue selling because the market will be headed to the neckline. I believe now I have laid my case. You now understand why you are buying. So someone will ask me, why is this market trying to buy? 
Why is it trying to buy? It's just an obstacle on four hour. So on four hour, what is happening? The market has this small double bottom. These are no obstacle, guys. Don't pay attention on this double bottom. It's just an obstacle. It's just an obstacle. So this double bottom, if you can see, the market has reached half. So the half of this uh, double bottom is where the market is now. So that's where our half is. That's where our half is. So the half, the market has reached half and that's exactly what is happening. The market has reached half and that's exactly what is happening. So don't, don't start thinking to buy. Focus on the daily. Go place your take profit as, at 2300 and allow the trade to run. It can take days. It can take weeks. It can take the whole of November. It can take the whole of December. For me, I don't know when they will get to our half, but I have shown you all the details that this market is going to sell. So we are using this double top as our entry. Thank you so much, guys. All the best. I hope you will make money with GBPUSD. Trade it, trade it until you exhaust it. And make sure you like this video. Make sure you comment and make sure you subscribe. Thank you so much. Love you.